Spurgeon here with Revzilla, and today we are taking a look at the Bell SX-1 whole shot graphic available at Revzilla.com. For you 80s Atari fans out there, this is the graphic for you. To me, the whole shot is very just kind of 80s video game inspired. You have the Space Invaders look up top. It's kind of coming down, screaming at you. And the whole helmet has a very fast feel compared to some of the other SX-1 graphics that we've seen from Bell. Now, if you're not familiar with the SX-1, this is going to be the entry level helmet in Bell's dirt lineup. So if you're just getting into dirt riding, or maybe you're looking for a helmet that's not going to break the bank, this is going to come in around the $100 price point. Polycarb shell, one shell size is available, and then sizing is going to change via three EPS liners. We threw this on the scale in the medium, comes in at three pounds, six ounces. Now this is gonna be a DOT only helmet, and for you riders out there that are just getting into this, you're not familiar with you know, how to fit up you know, the actual shape of your head, this is gonna be an intermediate oval helmet, and what that means for you, it's gonna be longer front to back, it's gonna be narrow on the side of the head, and it's gonna work for the majority of riders out there in the American market. Now, if you do wanna take a step up from this, maybe you wanna look at your other options, the next progressive step up from Bell is gonna be the MX-9. What the MX-9 gives you, it gives you increased ventilation as well as increased protection over the SX-1. But for those riders out there that are looking to get into this and you want a solid entry-level helmet, you can always check out the detailed breakdown video on the SX-1 where we show you everything that's going on. We take the insides of the helmet, we rip it out, and we give you all the details on this particular lid. For the whole shot graphic, symmetry is coming into play, very fast feel. You can see Bell kind of screaming down the side. The one thing that I really like is the base helmet is gonna be a gloss black, and then you have these very loud colors coming over top. Now, if you don't like the red and high-vis yellow, there is going to be a black, red, and white version as well. The one thing that you can notice here, if you look at the top, it's gonna to be a little bit hard to pick up on camera. While the rest of the colors are just done in a standard gloss, the red actually has a, a rich metal flake to it. You can see the metal flake as you look closely. It just offsets the colors and the tones compared to the regular gloss that you're gonna see throughout the rest of the helmet. As we pull around, you can see that bell wraps up at the back, and then the whole front of the helmet just pulls very nicely, just completing that fast feel. So for riders out there that are looking for a bell graphic that's a little bit outside the norm, maybe a little bit more 80s inspired from some of the other pieces that we're seeing, the SX-1 is one to consider with the whole shot graphic. Now there's a lot of riders out there that are utilizing SX-1 helmets on their rides, and if you wanna hear more about what they have to say, click the info button on your desktop or mobile device, which is gonna allow you to read other rider reviews from folks that are already out there putting an SX-1 through its paces. If you have more questions for one of our gear geeks as to which helmet is gonna be right for you and your setup, give them a shout, 877-792-9455, or simply shoot us an email, cs at revzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the Bell SX-1 whole shot graphic. I'm Spurge, enjoy the ride.